hi guys uh, i don't know if you can see me um so i i'm actually currently at aldi i had previously filmed this video but i don't know if it will make it but anyway i've come here with a shopping list so what i wanted to do is i wanted to do some baking i'm one i'm trying to you know prep my christmas meal ahead um of the day and, and because simply because i want to try some new things that i've not tried before so um so these are the recipes i found on my thermomix Therm thermomix <laughs> these are recipes that are from my thermomix so unfortunately i can't really you know share the recipes with you but um the good thing about it is that the bot rest um you can create like a shopping list so basically i've just downloaded the i mean the recipe on, on the thermomix the rest you can when you see a recipe that you like you can add it to a shopping list i have done it based on the um rest on the the food the meal itself that i want to prepare the recipe i want to prepare so you can arrange it based on the recipe or you can arrange it based on Maybe the t category or type of food, I mean, grocery you want to get. So, but I have done it based on the recipe because um, there are a few things here that I can, you know, swap for something else. Oh, my lips are so dry. I'm so sorry. Um, so, over here, I've got Christmas sausage roll. So, I want to make that. We, we like sausage roll in the house, in house. So, I want to make this one. Um, I think the only thing that I might swap for... I think it says it should add sage leaves. I'm not really good at cooking with sage. I've not really cooked with sage leaves before. So, something new. I mean, if I find it, I will. If I don't, I won't. Oh, yeah. I think what I might swap is chestnuts. Um, I use something else or just not put it at all. So, that's why I, I didn't want to just get it based on what I need for everything. Because then I don't know which one needs which one. Because I just can just remove it. So, and I just did it so that I can know which one I can maybe replace with another, depending on what kind of meal it is. And then we've got cinnamon stars here as well, something else I want to try. I'm going to put a picture next to, so you can see what they look like. And then I've got farmhouse fruit cake as well. I mean, you can I, can, can, I can use my phone for this, actually. I didn't have to print it out because I have the app on my phone, so I could have just used my phone. But I just thought it was easy to have a paper to just live through. Um, so for the fruitcake, it says brandy. But I'm, I'm not going to put brandy because we don't do alcohol in this house. So that was what I wanted to know. And a lot of these ingredients, they're just basic ingredients that you have at home that you need to get. So I'm getting like the, the flour, the raisins, the sugar, brown sugar. And um, yeah, so and the butter. I think the majority of the things I'm gonna use are mainly to do with butter. I'm gonna make some mince pies as well. Um, and I think I'll just I'll make my own mince meat. Um, so it's gonna be a, it's a bit of a twist um, as well. So yeah, so it's just for me to know the things I'm gonna get, and I'm gonna just get them quickly. I'm gonna try and bake a couple of them today. So like the sausage rolls and maybe the um and something else the fruit cake maybe i'll try and make today and yeah it's okay come along with me i'm a towdy now actually so um come along with me i don't know if i'm gonna take you along actually but i'll probably see you guys later i'll see you guys later anyway okay guys we're back and this is this are the things that i got okay let me just show you what i got so let me just show you this i got this out of i've been wanting to get one of this and i've been looking online the prices were not looking all right to me i feel like this was a good bargain so i got it not because well technically my christmas tree doesn't really have a lot of lights but it doesn't bother me i'm not bothered by that well i feel like in the future i will want something like this so this is a two, 200 led light warm light and it's got a remote control and um it's got a timer as well which i just think it's good it's a bargain because you don't get a lot of this thing. I mean, I think I was looking at. Let me like see. I was looking somewhere and it was just some ridiculous. But I got this for I think nine ninety nine, which I think is a reasonable price. I don't know if anyone will find it somewhere else cheaper. But I've been after this for a while now. Anyway, so that's by the way. So for my recipe, which is a Christmas dinner sausage rolls. I've got streaky bacon, so it calls for streaky bacon. 
um, six slices of streaky bacon. It calls for plain flour, but I just realized that I got self raising flour instead. I don't know why, because I think I was looking at the other recipes as well before I went and I went in and I realized that yeah, there was self raising flour there. Oh, this is plain flour. Anyways, I have got plain flour. Blah 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 blah. I think I've got plain flour at home, so I can use that. To be honest, guys, I don't think. I went to the wrong store. I when I got to Aldi, I realized that Aldi doesn't have quite the variety of things that I needed. So I'm gonna go to Morrison's instead because that's what we've got here. And to get this, like I didn't get talking mints because Aldi doesn't do them. Um, and I've got onions. I've got egg. I got some um, seasonings. So I got orange as well. That's no clementine. No easy peelers. Anyway, that's that. So I got salted butter, and it was when I was gonna get the butter I realized that oh no, because I normally get the plant one, and I'm just really short on time, and I'm just short on time. So I just got this. I will go back to Morrison's to get all the other recipe. I'm gonna say let me just. I'll probably call this as a a trial run of making the sausage rolls and then i'll go back next to morrissey next time and get the whole thing that i need i need to get that talking means i want i feel like it's gonna add more you know flavor to it so i got um uh, chipolatas um sausages or uh, just just chipolatas what's the difference guys tell me what's the difference between chipolatas and just sausage what well, i don't know anyway so i got those um 12. It says 340. The recipe called for 340 gram. How many gram is this one? I don't think it really matters, but I'm just out of curiosity. 375. Um, so for the seasoning, because it calls for I'm not gonna use chestnuts because I can't have nuts. Um uh obviously we've got sea salt, so it calls for sage leaf, pep black pepper. And yeah, that's the only two things else. I got olive oil. Um, I think next time I go to Costco, I'll get the big one. But I got this garlic infused one, and then from Aldi. So I got this jalapeno chili seasoning. Um, I found that there. I got from some time. I'm just talking up on some of my seasoning actually. I got this peri peri salt. I've been loving the Nando peri peri salt, it's just great for when you have chips, you just pour it on it but um i wanted to try this is and, and this is new at aldi so i wanted to try this and then oh i got two of those oh i got two oh okay <laughs> i got all oregano and then i got kanjin seasoning i love kanjin seasoning one of my favorite and that's all i got guys um so yes i'm gonna make the recipe now unfortunately i cannot share the recipe with you but i mean I'm sure every we can always Google this. Um, you can always Google this online. Uh, so I can't really tell you because I'm gonna be following what's on the thermomix and just it will do everything for me more or less. So I'm just gonna follow that and then I'll show you what happens at the end.
a star would it be too much to ask I'll place forever in your arms and for this moment to let 